This is gonna be a short little probably like five minute video because I got five minutes and then I go back. Um, people are actually out here like perpetuating this whole attention thing. Like people are out here teaching their children to be attention thirsty and to try to get your like if you're if you in I mean I'm not trying to say like people are bad or anything, but it's like if you focus on yourself, you're under attack. Like if you focus on yourself and you don't be like worried about all other people like that, the people who you ain't worried about, they're gonna be feeling some type of way, and they're gonna like people today in 2022, they feel entitled to your attention, and the fact that they feel entitled to your attention is just like if you if you're focused on yourself and you minding your own business, people are gonna be highly offended by that, especially if they like. I guess if they feel you're important, or if, if they think you're handsome, or if they're attracted to you, or if they, I don't fucking know, but maybe it don't got nothing to do with that, but in 2022, like, if you focus on yourself, you're under attack, people are going to take it as disrespect, they're going to take it as you being bougie, they're going to take it as you don't like them, or you don't want nothing to do with them, like, people are going to be highly offended just because you want to pay attention to yourself, focus on you, and not worry about nobody else. They're, they're, especially if you're a good looking person I'm going to say it, that's right If you're a good looking person, if you're a handsome person If you're an attractive person And you're focusing on yourself and not paying attention to other people They will feel some type of way about it And they will let you know They'll probably send their child over to you But you think it's the kid's just being a kid But no, they sent that child over there Purposely to whatever they're, Like they're teaching their children To be like an attention seeking person like, you don't want to focus on my kids. You don't want to tell me how cute my kids are. I'm going to send my kids over to you and make them make you see them. So, people are forcing themselves on other people who are worried about them. Like, if you're focused on yourself, if you mind your business, people are going to force themselves onto you. And they're going to feel entitled to you. They're going to feel entitled to your attention. They're going to feel that they deserve it. And they're going to want it. And if you don't give it to them, it's going to be a problem. And they're, they probably won't like you as much. And they're, they're not going to treat you like how they treat everybody else. You know, because you don't need them. And they can't understand that you don't, how you don't need them. Because they're so codependent on other people. There's nothing wrong with being codependent on other people. But I choose to just do me. I choose to... Um, stay focused on myself, I choose to not really worry about other people because I, um, I'm always thinking, I'm always either reading something or watching something important or meaningful to me or maybe I'm just focused on myself and mind my business. But it's just weird because like, I don't know, I really have a hard time trying to figure it out. But in 2022, if you if you focused on yourself and you ain't worried about other people and you're not paying attention to other people, you're going to be a target and you're going to be under attack. And they're going to attack you in the form of trying to distract you, trying to get on your nerves, trying to get in your way, being petty, doing just like little annoying stuff. So this is just a little short preview, a little four minute video, five minute video because I, I got to get back to work. And you hear them being loud and shit. They think I'm on the phone, but I'm not on the phone. I'm actually making a video about like, my, my experience that, here. But it is what it is, you know. Um, like, the same thing's happening with some of the co-workers. Like, some of the girls I really don't feel like that or I'm not interested in. Like, they feel some type of way that I don't be looking at them or I don't think they're cute or whatever. So, like, they get in my way. They try to get on my nerves. So, it's like... The thing is with some girls, if you don't like them, if you don't find them attractive, or if you don't think about them in a positive way, like, if you're not, like, drooling over them or worshiping them, like, oh, my God, she's so hot. Oh, my God, I'm only thinking about her. Oh, my God, I'm not even thinking about myself. I'm thinking about her so much. If you're not giving these females that type of energy, they're going to be annoying to you and get on your nerves. So you think about them in a negative way. But they don't care if it's positive or negative. If they're, All they care about is that you're on their mind. These people have retard spiritual abilities. They could feel when you think about them, and I think they could feel when you're not thinking about them. Like, I, I call that retard spiritual ability, because, like, your spiritual ability only goes so far, it's, like, capped off. It's like, oh, I could feel when somebody ain't thinking about me, or, oh, I feel this, the absence from this person not giving me no attention, or whatever the fuck it is, but... That should gotta be some type of retarded spiritual ability because it's like they like 25%, 15% of the way there, but they just don't go no further.
And it's just like, I, I, I don't know why. It'd be nice if they did. But hey, my five minutes is up. I'm out. I'll see y'all later.